Hey, hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I will be reviewing the Buff Bunny Collection Let's Get Toned launch going down this Saturday at 1 p.m. CST, so that's January 30th. You guys want to be sure to have your alarm set, have your phones ready because these pieces sell out quickly. This launch was inspired by the 80s, so there are so many different tone on tone variations that you guys are going to love. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how each and every piece fits. I'm going to show you a little material comparison on a few items and I will show you guys my number one favorite pick from the full launch as always I'm gonna put my stats here so that way if you guys have any questions you can make comparisons there but be sure to comment below any questions that you have specifically so that way I can get to these before the actual launch so let's get into the video all right guys I'm going to start with showing you all the tops that I received and then I will move into the leggings and shorts but I did want to quickly mention that I am currently wearing the Escandala pullover it is still available as of right now when I'm filming on the Buff Bunny collection website I love this casual little pullover I thought I would show you guys this one as well so the first bra I'm going to show you is the namaste sport bra in the color free falling um, I love the unique silhouette in this one and it adds that two-tone the two color variation the back is so pretty I love how it just breaks into those strappy um, cross backs so that way you can make it a little bit sexier in the gym and it just adds that little bit of oomph I'd say this is like a medium medium high compression I didn't have any slippage or anything like that but I will show it to you on here's the namaste sports bra right now I'm wearing it with the spin leggings so you can see uh, the color accentuation matches so very very cute there I love this silhouette and how it looks on it just has that pop to the bra so it does have these do have a thicker front strap which feel very comfortable and like I said it breaks into that cross back so it looks a little bit sexy, very, very cute overall. It's definitely a go-to on this one. I can do jumps and not go anywhere. Shimmy test, we're good. Next up, we have the Spin Sports Bra, and this is in the color High Voltage. This color is everything to me. When I made my choices this time around, I went with a little bit more uh, of a summery feel with the light colors, so you'll notice that throughout my uh, choices here. The Spin Sports Bra is very basic, I'd say. You can see that the back just comes along here, but what I do love about it is that it does have an accentuated bust. So you can see here that the cuffs, they have a little bit of an extra seaming, which really looks really cool in person. So I absolutely love this little Spin Sports Bra, more of a basic, medium compression, but definitely a must have. Now I have the spin bra on. I love how comfortable and soft this bra is. As I mentioned before, it is considered like a basic bra, but you can see that the accentuation in the bust lines adds that little extra oomph, and this color is clearly gorgeous. <laughs> so the back straps, super comfy, no crossovers or anything like that. So I am wearing this with the spin pants as well. Feels very comfy overall. I'll show you a shimmy test. Not moving. Definitely can do my hit workouts in this one as well. So this is the spin sports bra. Next up, I have the Material Girl ribbed tank in white. This tank is so cute because it can be paired as a casual. And for me personally, I'm more into um, wearing casual crops, especially with built-in bras. There's nothing better. So if you're into that type of look, this is definitely your sports bra. Now, the straps have a double strap, which is kind of different. I really love it. They're satin, so they look really pretty on. The rib material adds that extra little bit of texture, so it just looks really good on. On. So this is the material crop tank in white material girl as you can see this looks like a casual top on me Which I'm obsessed with because like I said it has that built-in bra So I just feel very put together overall. I don't have to worry about an extra strap with a bra um, And I kind of get a little bit of a push-up going here, which is so nice the back very basic with the pretty embellishment again though. Now with this crop top bra, I would say it's like a low compression. I wouldn't necessarily do burpees in it or do like a high intensity workout in it. As you can see here with the shimmy test, just not very strong. Jumping test, we're good. We can jump. It just doesn't feel necessarily uh, compressed down. But this ribbed material is just so different. It adds that texture. It just looks really nice on. And then the satin embellishment of the actual straps looks really, really pretty. So this is the material girl ribbed cropped up. Next up, we have the spin crop 
I would say it's a bra still, but this reminds me a lot of the Viva La Vibe bra. I, when I saw this, I'm like, heck yes. I love the color. It's so light and pretty. This is actually in the color pretty in pink, so it fits. <laughs> this is a, I'd say a medium compression and it's nice on. I do like the way it looks when it kind of falls down a little bit lower for the bras or crops as this one is considered. It does have a really pretty meshing and it's really, really comfortable on. This is the performance material. Once again, it is sweat wicking. It is so soft. This is the spin crop in pretty and pink. As you can see, there is very pretty mesh and the keyhole looks so good on. I love where this one cuts. It doesn't go too far down. It's like the perfect crop type bra. You can see the back. And on this one, you do have a high medium compression, not going anywhere at all. So very cute. Okay. Next up and one of my favorites, especially when it comes to the color is this spin crop. And this is in the color Breakfast Club. I am a sucker for tangerine and orangey type colors, so if you are too, this is your top. Now, I love the difference in this tank compared to other tanks in the past. They do the double strap on this one, and honestly, the quality of this material is even higher than the last launch. So every single launch, it's like we're making such a stride forward when it comes to the feeling of the material. So this is beyond amazing. It has the four-way stretch as well. This is the high-performance material, but like I said, I kind of shop for summer a little bit with this launch, and this is definitely a summer crop that I could pair with like jean shorts, or I could wear it to the gym with a pair of leggings. So yeah, that's the spin crop. Now this uh, crop top does not have a built-in bra or anything. I'm actually wearing this one braless and um, don't really have an issue with it, but if I were to do a workout, I would definitely require a sports bra or something underneath it. As I mentioned, I would probably use this one for more of like a casual wear with a pair of shorts, with a pair of jeans, something like that, because. I am obsessed with this color and I normally actually just wear sports bras in the gym. I don't wear crop tops over them. So the double straps look amazing as you can see. I had so much extra. So it's like every, every launch, Heidi has gone above and beyond to make everything just that much better. And it's like every launch. I can't expect anything more and then she blows me out of the water. Very pretty scoop back and scoop neck with this one. So you really can't go wrong with the spin crop because it is so basic and so nice and it's coming in a ton of colors. When I found out that Buff Bunny collection was dropping a bodysuit, I became very ecstatic because I've always wanted them to make one. So here we are with the bare bodysuit. Now, this bodysuit, I got to actually wear it out this last Friday night for dinner, and it was incredible. I got several compliments on it. I love, it's almost, I'd say, Jane Fonda inspired because it, the mesh detailing in the front, like I literally just wanna throw this on and do an 80s dance. <laughs> Anyhow, I love the back because the back is completely scooped and considered to be open. So it is very sexy when it's on. I've heard of some other girls actually working out in this bodysuit. I personally wouldn't work out in a bodysuit because I ain't trying to get a wedgie and <laughs> everything else, but this bare bodysuit is so freaking cute. This is the color Guns and Roses, which is the red color. I know it's coming in black and white as well. So if you're looking for, you know, some basic bodysuit that's also super sexy and has that extra look to it, then this is your one. I love the mesh accentuation on this one. It just makes it look so retro. Here you can see that it is a full thong in the back as well as a very, very deep scoop on this one. It looks amazing with jeans, even shorts. It's casual, but you can dress it up. And I love that they gave you that option. You can even, like I said, wear it to the gym. I don't think I will be, but here we are, the bare bodysuit. The last top I have here is the Arnold Bomber jacket. This is in the color white. This jacket is so warm. It is quilted. It is incredible on every aspect. The quality of this jacket is unparalleled, truly. I've never found anything like it, and it's funny because I was actually looking for a crop jacket this entire winter, so I wish I would have found this one sooner. What I love about the crop is that, you know, you can wear it and still flaunt the booty and things like that, so obviously this jacket is in the color white. I believe it's coming in black and red as well. So this jacket is by far 
uh, my favorite jacket that Buff Bunny collection has launched up to date. So the Arnold Bomber jacket. It looks so classy and so nice overall. The quality on this one, you can just see it. With the quilted pattern and everything, it's just so different than anything that you would normally see when it comes to jackets. So you can see the height here is literally perfect for hitting the buns in just the right place. For me personally too, it, I actually like to wear belts with my pants, so then you can still kind of see the belts underneath in the back. Truly, this jacket, you you need it. Like everyone needs this jacket in their life and I just can't get over how warm it is because the collection in general hasn't made any, or at least that I've gotten or received besides the teddy coat, really, really warm stuff. So I would have to say this is the warmest jacket that I've ever received and I am obsessed with this. So you can definitely utilize it this winter. And then since it's white, you can even wear it in the summer too. So this is the Arnold Bomber jacket. Okay, now I'm gonna get into the leggings and shorts for this collection. So the first leggings are these step up leggings. This is the color Guns and Roses. These are the performance materials. So they are sweat wicking and very soft and smooth when you wear them, which is really nice if you uh, are like me and your thighs rub a little bit in the middle. Um, it just feels like you're moving really well in these pants. So these do have a secure waistband. There is no front seam, which is very, very nice as well. I do love that this launch went for the no front seam type deal. Now there is also a contouring booty. So you can see that it comes down and just makes that very flattering booty look. Now, also with these leggings, they do have a accentuated seam. So it's like a style seam on these, which I love. All right, here I am wearing the step up legging in the color Guns and Roses. I accidentally ordered a size medium, which just reminds me in the future to or always order true to size with Buff Bunny collection. I am a size small in their leggings because I like how they fit. They stay up really well when I do wear a size small. So you can see in these leggings that the glute is quite a bit accentuated. Now you can't see in this video, but I'll show you on this squat video the actual accentuated seams on these leggings. So overall, they are a very, very soft fit, super sleek, you feel good. Um, I would say these are like a performance legging. You can use them for pretty much any type of workout, but overall, very nice. Next up is the spin legging. So these have the four-way stretch performance material. I love these leggings. These are a little bit thinner, I'd say, than the step-up leggings. Um, I really liked these leggings on. I didn't think I would like them as much until I put them on. <laughs> so these also do have no front seam as well, and I found that they're just extremely flattering on the buns. This is the color Total Eclipse, and I actually paired this with the Namaste Sports Bra the other day, and it was so freaking cute. So I am very, very into these leggings. They are super thin and just very nice overall. As you can see, there's no front seam, so it is very flattering from the front angle. But moving to the back here, you can see the accentuated glute on this one, which I absolutely am dying for. Now, these leggings, like I said, they're really, really thin, so they just feel so light on, and I will show you guys the squat test as well. These are just great overall leggings. I do, as I mentioned, they do have the softer feel. These are the high performance sweat making material. Uh, really, you can't go wrong with these leggings. The Material Girl ribbed legging. This ribbed legging has taken ribbed leggings to the next level. <laughs> I am obsessed with these. These are in the color nude. They have a special metal embellishment in it that I absolutely love. And these do have an accentuated booty in the back. I wore these on leg day and I'd have to say they are extremely stretchy, very nice overall, very comfy. They're not pulling down the entire workout, which I find with a lot of leggings. So the Material Girl ribbed leggings are definitely a new favorite of mine and these are in the color nude. I wasn't into the ribbed leggings that they came out with six or so months ago and I'll show you that in a little bit with a comparison of the two different materials. But this is a very, very soft material um, for the ribbed leggings and I love the color nude. I always have um, for something, it just looks like, you know, Nikki in the gym, no problem. This is actually paired right now with the Material Girl ribbed crop which just looks very good overall with the two embellishments on here. This also does have that booty accentuation which I'm living for. There is no front seam on these leggings, so they are overall very nice. They are definitely squat proof. Even being nude, 
still squat proof. So these are definitely a new favorite of mine. All right guys, so I wanted to compare the fabric for you of the last ribbed legging compared to this ribbed legging. So you can see that these crisp lines are so much different than the last rib legging. Personally, like I said, I wasn't the biggest fan of this one, but now that the lines are so tight and clean, it looks 10 times better. All right, last but not least for the entire launch are the spin shorts. Honestly, these are my favorite shorts that the Buff Bunny collection has launched to date. Reason being, these little silicone beads on the bottom. So they've actually gone to the length of putting this little silicone piece here to make sure that the shorts don't ride up. For me, and if you have larger legs, thighs especially, shorts tend to ride right up. And constantly pulling them down throughout my workout, it can be so annoying. They've solved the issue <laughs> with that, with these spin shorts. So I hope they continue this with the future. It is something that I am freaking loving. These are in the color Atari, launching in three other colors. So the spin shorts are definitely a must have. I will show them to you guys on. I love these because they do not have a front seam either. Other shorts that I've worn in the past, when they have a front seam, it can be very unflattering. So these are extremely nice. Now they are not going anywhere. No matter how much movement, I love that they don't move. You can feel the silicone grabbing onto your legs. And these also have the booty accentuation, which just looks so good, especially on shorts. I am hoping in the future that they continue on with these silicone little pads because they are to die for. As we all know, the way a legging fits is incredibly important. So I actually created a few little squat videos for all of the leggings that I received in this launch so that way you can see how they move with me. I really wanted to show you guys the different colors and textures and how vibrant they truly are. I mean, it's just unreal, these colors and textures. 80s, baby. Guys, that wraps up my Let's Get Toned launch review. I'm so thrilled for this launch once again this Saturday. Don't forget to use my support code, which is just Rachel, as it goes to directly supporting me and my little diabetic baby here. So thank you guys. Mm-hmm.